What would happen if Lamar Jackson was shrunken to the size of a football? Well, with some special help from the Madden modding community, we're about to find that out. <laughs> this experiment is gonna be one like no other. As you could probably imagine, Lamar Jackson's career started off pretty rough, getting clobbered down by the Houston Texans, then taking a loss in week two versus Cincinnati. We have to go a very long way, people. That's a start. Come on, Lamar. No! We just lost. It wasn't even our fault this time. Very quickly, we were off to an 0-3 start and last in the AFC North. But despite the awful start, Lamar didn't give up and had a bit of a turnaround in week number four. This has been so difficult so far. I need a little bit of hope. Hey, we got it. Oh, that's gonna be a touchdown as well. Heck yeah, good start. But trust me, it was still not easy. Run, Lamar, run. This could be all you. Oh, heck yeah. You can't get me. Yes, again. I lied, I'm sorry. We can't afford to punt right now. Cleveland just scored off of us. Mark Andrews, no! Can't get the ball over the line. Come on, catch our groove. There it is, that is what I'm talking about. But like I said, this was Lamar's game. <gasps> That's press. That's press. Odell, you gotta get that. You gotta get that. Yeah! Oh, we got an open lane. You cannot catch me! Oh, they actually can't catch me! Yes! Wait, Lamar, where are you going? Oh. I think you just left the game. And I figured since I run this far, maybe I just run across the great state of Alabama. What do we do now? All right, hear me out. It's deep in the fourth. All that we have to do is run out these three minutes. The problem, we're sitting here on the three yard line. We got an RPO or a read option. Sorry, my bad, my bad, my bad. Oh, it's going to work. We almost took that all the way. This is gonna be super good for us, I think. Wait, I got one over the top. A dime over the top to Odell! Boys, I think we just ended this game. Justin Tucker was able to seal the game out for us and get us our first win. Moving ahead in the season was definitely more promising for Jackson, but that didn't mean that it came with its fair share of frustration. Wait. <coughs> what just happened? I think he just fumbled the snap. Oh my god! The ball went right past him. That's not even his fault. Baltimore was now 6-7, and seven, heading into a crucial Week 14 matchup for Trevor Lawrence and the 12-1 and one Jacksonville Jaguars. We're going to take a quick pause in today's video because it is brought to you by none other than Dr. Squatch. And they're genuinely blessing us with such a good deal that even I have taken advantage of it to get Christmas presents for some family members. Here's the deal. New customers are going to get three free soaps when you purchase the buy three, get three bundle using my special link which is linked at the top of the description of this video you are literally getting $28 off on this deal averaging out to about $4 per bar or so I personally use Dr. Squatch every day for almost a year now so I can personally vouch for their products and their scents are incredible as well number one has definitely got to be Fresh Falls it's my go-to soap and if you want something a little more subtle I like to go with Birchwood Breeze love the scent not too overpowering it's perfect for pretty much everyone if you've ever wanted to try Dr. Squatch now is without a doubt the best time to do so with this incredible deal. One more huge thanks to them for being a part of my everyday routine. Again, if you're interested, there will be a link at the top of this video's description. Win this game and move into a potential wild card spot, lose, and we'll still be on the outside looking in. Let me tell you, it did not take long for the Jags to do what they've been doing all season. A flawless drive for them to get up 7-0 early. Okay, Jags have come to ball. We knew that that was going to happen. Andrew! You have no clue the amount of times that I've done that. We really do have to roll out of the pocket as much as we possibly can. Oh, I gotta try it. See, that one made it through. That, oh. oh that was almost incredible. Hit him with that play action, and now we roll. No shot. That was incredible. That spark from Lamar Jackson really got the team going and helped them put in a touchdown themselves their first drive. Oh, we're so backed off. I gotta try Andrews, and we got a touchdown. There it is, tied up. The AFC leading Jags still weren't done yet though, going two for two with two touchdowns. Luckily before half, Lamar was able to make a couple big plays to set up Justin Tucker for a field goal. We're going read option. I gotta hand it off to Dobbins. Come on Dobbins, there it is. And we got it, yes! I have no idea what's gonna happen here. Oh my God. That almost ruined things. He's not able to get these handoffs and shovels off clean. 
and it's slowing down our offensive weapons. Hey, here we are. This is the spot we want to be. It's got to be Dobbins. This game's so important. I'm getting in with anybody. Oh, the Jags weren't able to score. We got the ball back. After a few clutch plays by the offense, Coach Harbaugh set up a masterpiece. We got to get in here. Odell. We got the blocking. I think we got the win. We're up by two scores now late in the fourth quarter. A 24-21 win in the biggest game of the regular season. Turns out that win was exactly what this team needed to slide right into a playoff spot. Job's not finished. By the way, if you're interested in the stats, we were 28 in passing yards. This was very difficult, okay? But we did have 830 rushing yards, the player that's only a couple inches tall. On top of that, we had a home playoff game. Hopefully we can give ourselves a chance versus the Tennessee Titans. Here's the situation, boys. A pretty low-scoring, uneventful game thus far. Hopefully we can pick stuff up and turn things around a little bit here. I gotta try Odell one-on-one -on -one every chance that I can. Get up! Oh! What a throw from Lamar. He's this tiny. He's throwing the ball 70 yards. But just like all season, luckily, J.K. Dobbins was there to help us out. So hard to throw in the pocket. We're going to get that one, though. Mark, first down. There he is again. Nice. Super good. Come on, we'll hit him with it. Play action. Is it there? Oh! <gasps> Scored. I thought that was picked because of that low trajectory, but it went to him. Here we are with a 10-point lead. On the other end, Derek Henry was able to help the Titans make this a one-possession game again. Got the QB wrap. Good block. Good block. I love this. This is so nice. This is beautiful. We run down. We score a touchdown. We'll be moving on to the divisional round. No mistakes. Come on. Mark Andrews can't be covered right now. We're going to utilize him. We got him. I think we're in. That's a touchdown. We should be moving on to the divisional round. Once again, a perfect play call in the red zone was huge for us. After the win, we are back home to take on the New York Jets. The Jets were in this spot because of their stellar defense, and that proved to be true in the first half. I know I probably should be running the ball with Dobbins quite a bit more. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Dobbins! Come on now. Some more of this. Is he there? I don't even know if he's there. I got to come back. And that's good. Oh, brother, this is so bad. Luckily, we're in field goal range, so we have a tie game. Things were heating up as the Jets scored a touchdown right back after a pretty good drive so far. Oh, that's an X factor. I'm really glad that was just incomplete. Third down and goal. It's Gus Edwards time, and we got the block, and we're keeping it a game, people. This time, the Jets only put up three. <sighs> Lamar, where are you? Oh, you're back behind that dude's butt. Okay. This is kind of now or never, dude. I don't know. I got him. That was picked midfield. Come on. We could do this. We could do this. Running back. Way to fit that through. I love it. We got the triple option. No, 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 not the time. We have a 62-yard field goal with six miles per hour wind in our face. Perfect. And Tucker is doing it divisional playoffs people the ensuing possession the jets retaliated with a field goal of their own here we are 50 some seconds with no timeouts run them run them run them oh he's so slow if it's not a designed run i gotta hurry up we gotta at least get in field goal range i don't have a choice we didn't we didn't go 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 i'm trying it i have to i'm catching it i'm catching it how do i spike Oh no, 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 no. We're going for the win, baby! Oh my. Oh my. Hope you enjoyed the video, people. That was a disappointing way to end things.